so hi babes welcome back to my youtube channel if you're a returning subscriber you know that you're always welcome you guys are the best i appreciate you all for always coming back to see my videos but if by chance it's your first time stopping by this channel or even coming across it at all thank you for clicking and for watching this video so guys on today's video i'm going to be doing my skincare routine i've been getting a lot of questions as to what i use on my face what's your skincare routine can you make a video of your skincare routine and today i decided to answer that question i mean why not so guys on this video i'm going to be showing you every single thing that i use on my face although this is an updated skincare routine but what I do is that from time to time as a skincare vendor, I use my skin as a testing ground to test out some products before selling them to my customers. So my skincare routine is a bit scattered. It's not coordinated. I use a whole lot of things. I use some things and then if they're not good, I trash them and so on. I, I do this to know how safe these products are. My skin is not sensitive at all and that makes it possible for me to be able to try out different products on my skin so these are the ones that i'm using presently this is my updated skincare routine so without further hesitation let's get right into the video so like i said earlier i use a lot of things on my face so this is alpha abutin collagen soap every single thing that i'll be displaying on this video i sell them i'm a skincare vendor so i sell them if you'll be needing anything that i use on this video just do well to message me and then the rest will be history okay so this is alpha abutin collagen soap i use this it is a face soap it contains abutin and so on it is such a lovely soap actually it is one of my best sellers it is a very very good soap so use this soap this is foreign extract soap foreign extract soap i'm sure some of you know that there are two types of extra soap so this is the foreign one made in the philippines there's another nigerian made but this is the one i use it is a face and body soap so these are the two face soaps that i use so on this video i'm going to be using extract i'm not going to be using that alpha button i used it yesterday so i'm going to be using extra soap today although sometimes what i do is i apply the soap on my face for a few minutes that's if you want to get the best out of it you apply the soap on your face for a few minutes let it sit on your face for a few minutes so it will be able to do a better job before rinsing it off or before using your sponge to wash it off but for the sake of this video i'm trying to make everything a bit snappy so so wash my face with this every corner of my face so this is what my face looks like after washing it off so ensure you have a face towel do not use your body towel on your face so ensure you have a face towel so i'm just going to do this so this is something else i used to use before although it's exhausted this is a face wash. It contains niacinamide. And what niacinamide does is that it helps to feed dark spots. So if you're dealing with dark spots, go with products that contain niacinamide. Yes. Very good skincare routine consists of a face wash or a face soap. And then you go in with your toner. That is what I'm about to do right now. So after your toner, then you can go in with your serums. After your serums, your moisturizer. And lastly, your sunscreen which is very very important it's a very very important step when it comes to skincare okay so let's go in with the toner I'm just going to have it on my palm like this and then dab it on my face Skincare is not hard. Skincare is not hard. As long as you're following the rules, it's not hard. So, I also get it. Also, make sure it gets to my neck as well. So, this is a hyaluronic toner. Like I said earlier, everything used in this video, I sell them. So, if you need anything, I'm at your service. So, this is a hyaluronic toner. It helps what? What it does is that it helps to keep your face hydrated, helps to keep your face plumped. It also comes in another variant, which is the niacinamide, and it's also Dr. Rachel. That one helps. I've said what niacinamide does. 
so it comes in two variances but this is the one i use depends on your skin problem you choose the, your toner according to your skin issues okay so after using your toner you leave it for um, a few seconds in order for your face to absorb the toner so this serum is turmeric serum i also sell this so this is the serum i used to use before it is finished it is finished so there's nothing left so um this is my vitamin c toner vitamin c helps in brightening the skin helps in brightening the face so this is the new one that i'm using you guys should bear with me this is the new one that i'm using i used to use the pi my but that one is also finished i do not have the bottle here to show you guys but i'm sure you know pi my vitamin c serum so this is a new one that i'm using so i'm going to go in with my vitamin c serum when applying your serum do not let it touch your face just apply it like so and then you rub it in Rub it in a circular motion. Rub it in. Rub it in like this. And then after rubbing it in, you're still going to let it sit. Skincare requires patience. If you do not have patience, don't even start. If you don't have patience, don't start. I'm telling you. Okay? It requires your patience, your attention. You just need to be intentional about your skin to be intentional about your skin and ensure you're getting it right this is the next serum that i use yeah you can use more than one serum you can use more than one serum nobody should deceive you and say hey you're not supposed to use more than one serum this and that no you can use more than one serum i like to be generous with it and one thing i love about this very one is that it is very very hydrating like when i say hydrating it is very very hydrating i love it so so much so going with this you can see how shiny my face looks now you can see right how shiny my face looks like i said i like to apply it on my neck oh, so that my neck will be glowing as well <laughs> you know what i mean so hmm, you can see that glow right so after letting this sit the next thing we're going to be using is our moisturizer so after letting our serum sit for a while on the face so those are the two moisturizers that i use this is more like a face cream it is called half cast vitamin c face cream i do not actually use it every time like when it comes to skin i use different things my face is not sensitive so i test product on my face and this is um the goji berry moisturizer so i mostly use this at night it contains retinol it contains hyaluronic acid it is hydrating i love it so so much so i use this vitamin c face cream in the morning vitamin c is best used in the morning to get the best results so this is what i use in the morning you can see i use it in the morning and then this is what i use in the evening but i just feel like using this now so let's use this now i don't apply it too much just go in with it just like that during the heat period i used to find it so hard to do my skincare because then when you do your skincare, you'll be sweating like a Christmas goat. <laughs> but at least this wet there, and for the fact that there's light, it makes it easier for you to do your skincare. So, and this moisturizer gives you that glow. Like whenever I apply it, my face, like I, I can't really explain, but it just gives you that glow. And it is very hydrating too so the star of the show and the very last step of skincare which is your sunscreen i'm actually not going out so there's no reason for me to use sunscreen but i'm just going to do it so i'm going to be using um why is it not coming out 
apply your sunscreen. I use more than this when I'm going out, but for the fact that I'm inside, and I'm just applying it for the sake of this video, so let's just go with this. So when you apply it all over your face, it's good that you let it sit for some time before finally massaging it properly. The importance of a sunscreen. Huh? Sunscreen is very, very important when it comes to skincare. Very, very important. So, I'm going to let it sit for some time. I know I look crazy, but just trust the process. Okay. So, you can see that glow, right? Huh. See how my skin is glowing. Oh my God. So it is good to reapply your sunscreens every two hours. So I have a, a video on this channel, on my channel here. I made a review about Dr. Rachel sunscreen. And on that video, I said everything or the important things you need to know about skin, about um, sunscreen story. So this is the final result. Mm. So you can see how sweet I look. This sunscreen is very affordable. This is the SPF 70. I have the SPF 80, 50 and so on. It is very affordable and it does not leave a white cast. It doesn't leave a white cast. So the very last thing that I'm going to be doing right now is to moisturize my lips as well. Guys, we all know this is Nigeria, so kindly disregard every background noise you're hearing in this video. This is Nigeria, and as a content creator, you just have to live with it. You can't help it. Okay, so kindly disregard every background noise and just focus on the video. We've actually come to the end of this video, and if you watch till this very point, kindly like this video you can share this video and comment under this video any video you want me to make i'm here for you guys talking about any skincare products or whatsoever kindly leave that on the comment section and do not forget to subscribe to this channel this channel brings you juicy skincare reviews every single thing you need to know about skincare okay so until i come your way next time 